Now some people are stuck without heat in this winter storm. But Texarkana Fire is warning you to be careful about how you heat your home. NBC6's Epiphany Lachey joins us now live taking a look at the dangers of carbon monoxide. Epiphany? Yeah, Texarkana fire officials say calls have risen regarding carbon monoxide checkup scares that are urging locals to stay warm, but do it in a safe way. Having a grill or, or even some people will use their you know, gas stove to, to heat your home. And, you know, it's, it's very dangerous because there's nothing there to vent it out of the home and it's giving off carbon monoxide as those flames are burning. And carbon monoxide is an odorless, colorless gas. Officials say inhaling it can be deadly. Here are some warning signs. Just overall bad feeling, uh, headaches, uh, things like that, you know, possible nausea. Officials warn you not to sit inside of your car in an enclosed area to keep warm. You know, it, it's, it feels good, but really if you don't have electricity and aren't able to have properly working gas heat, uh, layers of clothes, blankets, put on coats and stuff, it's, it's not the most best way to stay warm in this type of environment climate, but uh, it's a lot safer. Generators should be used outside, away from windows and doors. Fireplaces and space heaters should be given room to breathe. The safest way to do it for in-home, like if you have gas heated appliances, your stove, your heater, anything like that, is, is have it checked by a professional to make sure it's operating correctly and efficiently. Carbon monoxide detectors are encouraged. And if you are without heat, warming stations are available at the shelters in downtown Texarkana. Reporting live here in Texarkana, Texas, Epiphany Lachey, NBC6 News. All right, Epiphany, appreciate it. Well, stay with us. Chief Meteorologist Todd Warren is sharing your full forecast.